A couple of quick points on maps. So we did improve the interpretations component in the maps app. So now it's the same as the data visualizer and line listing application. We also in the thematic layers have an option for viewing only completed events. And um, we did make some significant performance improvements to the Google Earth engine aggregations. So those population layers that have become very popular quite quickly um, are now going to be um, loading a little bit faster. Uh, and we see that this is a really popular feature, has become a very popular feature in a relatively short period of time. Um, and we've gotten feedback that that uh, it was taking too long for some of those to load. So luckily we were able to make some performance improvements. So, so now you'll see those detailed population layers coming through Google Earth Engine loading faster in the Maps app. We also managed to backport that to 236. So if you're not using the latest version of DHIS2, as long as you're using up to 236, you'll still see those performance improvements. So now that was my very short but sweet analytics. I'll hand it off to Lars.